Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I wanted to share my favorite comfy, cozy pieces to wear around the house from my favorite pajamas and loungewear or Amazon leggings, just anything that I typically wear around the house. I figured I would do a little try on haul and share those with you guys today. Before I do, I just wanted to check in with you guys and see how you're doing and send you all a big virtual hug right now. I know this is a very stressful, uncertain time that we're all going through and I hope we can all continue to show each other grace during this time and a little more understanding and patience as we all try to navigate this new normal for the next few months. And I also just wanted to say thank you to all of those working on overtime right now from our healthcare providers, our legislators, people restocking shelves with food and grocery store employees and pharmacists. Just there's so many people that are continuing to support their communities and I've seen some really positive things already come out of this as far as posts on Facebook where others are just extending that helping hand and supporting children who need food and grocery shopping for the elderly right now. It's just it's nice to see those positive things and I've even tried to share some positive stories that I've seen just because I feel like we can all use a little bit of that right now and Tim and I are social distancing as much as possible right now. I've canceled all my upcoming travel and we're not making any runs out of the house that aren't necessary. So as far as my upcoming videos and what I have planned, I hope to keep things as normal seeming as possible. It is somewhat kind of uncomfortable to continue on as though nothing's happening, but I'm, I'm just going to try to do that because I feel like we can all use that positive distraction. And I may even be posting more videos than usual, we'll see, but I'll be spending less time running errands around the city and running to Target. I feel like there may be an opportunity to share more here and I would love to know what you guys would like to see from me as well. So just checking in with you guys and hope that everyone stays healthy and safe and if you have any sort of positive thing to share down in the comments I'd love to hear from you guys whether you saw a really uplifting video or um, I just love to know what you guys are up to down in the comments below and just a quick side note I am refilming this intro today as the video goes up just because my emotions were running a little high when I originally filmed this on Sunday and I just felt like I was rambling so that's why I'm wearing something different today, but let's jump into my favorite loungewear pieces. All right, so starting off with what I'm currently wearing today, I have on some black leggings. These are from Amazon. They are, I would say they're kind of an in-between to the Wonder Under and the Lululemon Align. I feel like they're not like either, but they're kind of a middle ground between the two. My personal favorite legging is the Align legging. It's just extremely comfortable. Although I will say you do have to worry about a little bit of camel toe with those. <laughs> They're just not as tight and supportive. Um, but I wear them around the house all the time. They're super comfortable. These are a really good black legging from Amazon. Have on my normal size small. I would say they're kind of like an, a 7 8 or ankle fit. I also have on some Ugg slippers. I live in these slippers around the house. Not sure if they're still available considering the time of year, but they're usually included in the Nordstrom anniversary sale. And then for my sweater, I actually have this in two colors. This is like a really pretty blush color and then I have like a more neutral kind of yellowy beige. And these have a really good length to wear with leggings. You can wear it cute with like a white jean or you can wear it around the house because it's just very soft and comfortable. I have on the small medium size. If you want it to be even more oversized, you could size up, but I kind of like the fit as is. It does have kind of a wider V-neck and these are just really soft and comfortable. So that's what I'm actually wearing today. And now I'll show you guys a couple other favorite loungewear pieces. Also, I just wanted to mention, there are a lot of days where I am at home. I don't have any plans to leave the house. I do like to give myself at least one makeup free day a week have my hair in a messy bun, you know, not always looking presentable like this, and that's totally okay. I think we all need those days, but if you're finding yourself feeling really blah and you're spending a lot of time at home like we all should be right now, I would recommend to get ready for the day. I feel like even if you don't plan on leaving the house, it does help you feel a little bit better when you shower, get your hair ready, do your makeup, even if it's not a full face of makeup or if you don't wear makeup 
you don't have to put makeup on to feel better, but I find that if I'm feeling a little more blah, if I put myself together, it kind of helps turn my day around as well. So I have on that same sweater, and these are my absolute favorite loungewear pants. So I have these pants in this lighter gray and then a darker gray. They are definitely worth picking up multiples in, in my opinion, if you like wearing comfy things around the house. They are a little bit warmer, so if you are very, very hot-natured, you may want to pass on these, but by far my favorite lounge pant. They are super soft and comfortable, and these have the reputation of being called the butter pants because they are that soft and that comfortable. So I love these cozy tops from Target. I actually have a gray and white version as well. I got this one last year. I wore this one yesterday around the house. They're pretty much the same thing. Um, they are from A New Day, and I think I sized up in these. I know I have a medium in this one, but I'm not sure the size on this one. I'll put it in the description box below. But I do love the color combination of this one. Again, this is a piece I wear around the house because it's soft and comfortable, but I also wear it out of the house as well. Um, I'll link a picture here. I wore it with white jeans the other day. So these are some of my favorites to get, and I love the length as well. So if you're wanting to mix up your looks for around the house, you could do like a cozy jumpsuit. This is from the Stars Above collection at Target, which is extremely soft and comfortable, a little bit thinner. I will say if you're going the jumpsuit route, just know that it's going to take, you know, a little more effort to use the restroom and things like that. Uh, but I still think it's a really cute and comfy option to wear around the house. I have my normal size small on, and again, it's v-neck. This one has full shoulder coverage, a little more narrow in the ankles, and I think it comes in multiple colors as well. So these pajamas are honestly a little hard to get your hands on because I know a lot of other bloggers are sharing them, and they're such a good price on Amazon, but I just got this set in. This is very similar, honestly, to a Victoria's Secret version that I've had for years, and I've been trying to get my hands on the pink leopard, but it always sells out. <laughs> so I'm going to keep my eye on it. I think it's supposed to restock in April. These are really cute. They're like a silky material. This is a pretty like pink and white stripe. It has a really good fit. Honestly, like I think if you want a little extra room, you may want to size up. I'm wearing the small and it has a really flattering fit. But if you're wanting like that extra super comfy fit, then definitely size up. So these pajamas are wrinkled because I wore them early in the week, but still wanted to grab them to show you guys. These are from Soma. You probably, if you've seen me on stories, you will definitely recognize these. I wore them from Instagram, but I wear these all the time. They are lightweight, so you won't get too hot in them. I think they have some sort of cooling effect. I'm not, don't quote me on that, but I think that's what I've read. I can actually wear these to sleep, which I don't wear a ton of like pants to sleep, but I find that these are lightweight and comfortable enough that I can actually sleep in them. I have on my normal size small. And then speaking of Soma, so if you're looking for a bra comfortable enough to wear around the house, this is my go-to. It is so comfortable. This is the only one that I don't rip off as soon as I get home and I actually forget I have it on. So day to day, I do try to wear these even to work if I can, as long as my shirt, you know, isn't going to show the straps up here. They are very seamless and comfortable, very thin. So this is the one I would wear around the house if you're looking for something like that. So I also really love this Amazon sweater. I've worn it a ton since I got it. I wore it up in New York for fashion week. It's long enough to wear with leggings. So I've paired it really often with the Spanx leather leggings when I'm dressing up, but I also wear it around the house because it is soft and comfortable. And these leggings are from Allo or Alo. I'm not sure how you say it. They make really fabulous leggings. They're my favorite for pure bar. I'm not sure if this exact color is still available, but I shared these actually last year. So I've had them a year. They wash and wear so, so well. They also have extra length, which is great for Pure Bar to pull them up over your socks, but I also love the color as well. Here's a better look at this sweater. It has like a roll neck, and I would say keep it light. Like don't wear a white bra underneath this because it will show through. Um, if I wear like a pink bra, it will show through, so definitely keep it nude underneath. And it has kind of like a bat sleeve. I think they have these in multiple colors as well, like probably 10 different colors, and it's longer in the back. It's kind of similar to like the free people one 
Honestly, it's softer than the Free People one as well. So this is that cozy top that I featured in my Petal and Pup try-on haul earlier this year. I knew it was going to be one of my most worn pieces because I wear it all the time around the house and it's just so soft and comfortable. I actually think I may have found a dupe on Amazon. I can't confirm it. I haven't ordered it to try it. I can do that. But just at the time of filming, I haven't. But I'll link it down below. It looks very similar. And I wear this thing all the time. I love the length for leggings. I can wear it with like jeans and boots and be kind of casual cute. But I wear it all the time around the house because it is just so soft and it has a really great length to it. I just threw on those Amazon leggings that I had on earlier and I'll probably stay in this the rest of the night. So I also have a couple cardigans to share that I wear around the house often. I usually throw these on if I have on like a workout tank because I'm always cold around the house or if I just have on a basic v-neck kind of t-shirt type of thing just because I'm always cold like I said. So this one is from Goodnight Macaroon. It's called their travel cardigan. And it's, again, it's almost the same material as the shirt. It, I would say it's like 5% less soft, but it's still really soft. And it is long as well. I actually wear this out of the house as well with like normal clothes. But I do find myself wearing it a lot around the house as well. And I think this is a one size type of situation. So... And then the last cardigan I reach for around the house is my Barefoot Dreams cardigan. This one I reach for if I'm really cold because I find that it's a little bit warmer than the other one. It's a little bit thicker and just the material in general I feel like is warmer. So I also wanted to show you guys these really cute slippers. And these are, I think, technically slippers, but you can actually wear them out of the house as well. They have like neutral colors that you can wear to work. I wouldn't probably wear these out of the house. In fact, I have never worn them out of the house, but my friend got me these for Christmas and they are very comfortable. So if you're looking for something fun that you can kind of wear around the house, I think these are fun. I, the glitter might be sold out or if you're just looking for a comfortable work shoe, I think these are a really good option and like a neutral color. Those are all my favorite comfy cozy pieces to wear around the home. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you very soon in my next video.